March book haul. Uh, this is going to be March book haul with games and a little bit of movies. Um, I had a little bit of surgery on my teeth, but I had to get my tooth pulled. So I haven't, I didn't do Friday reads um, because I had gone in Friday to get the surgery. So I wasn't able to do Friday reads because, again, my mouth was sore from the surgery. Um, and then yesterday, I would go through a bunch of stuff. Yesterday, I had like flu-like symptoms. I had like a bad fever. I was throwing up. So today, I kind of feel a little bit better. So I wanted to film a video with you guys because I didn't want to leave you guys without a video for a while. So um, I wanted to do my March book haul. Uh, March, I didn't pick up many books. Um, I sold some books to my friend Laura, which is Mom of Triplets 03. Um, and she picked up two books for me. She picked up um, Heart of Iron by Ashley Poston. Poston. Uh, this is supposed to be an Anastasia retelling. I've never read Anastasia or watched Anastasia. I think Anastasia is a Disney movie, I think. I've never heard about it. Um, but I've heard so many good things, some mixed reviews about this. Um, this was a, it was an Owl Crate book, so I kind of did want to get it. The Owl Crate one is beautiful. It has, like, purple pages and it's so pretty. Um, this is Outcast, Rogue, Orphan, and Rebel. I believe this one is about a girl. Uh, she... 17 year old Anna, uh, her android goes missing and she needs to go find find it and um, she ends up, yeah, she has to save her android and she meets with this person, this guy and so I my synopsis is very like out of there because again I haven't read these books yet, I've been really reading Harry Potter mostly but um, yeah, uh, she was saved by, by her android and now her android goes missing and she needs to find, um, well, she's one of the last remaining illegal metals. She's been glitching, and Anna will stop at nothing to find a way to fix them. So, it says, it's supposed to be good. And she wrote Geekerella. I haven't read that book, but I do have that one, too. Got that one. And then she picked up Honor Among Thieves, which this is, I think, like space pirates, maybe? It says... A hundred were chosen, one will resist. And this is by Rachel Kane and Anna Guire. Uh, Anna Guire, she wrote uh, Enclave, Enclave. I did read that book and I did like it. Um, this one says, let's see. Sahara Cole has been in and out of New Detroit's rehab facility for treatment of her antisocial behavior. There's no adjusting, adjusting Zahara's attitude throughout a painful past has made her stronger than most, which is why she chose she chose as, geez, I can't talk. Chooses life in the zone and instead of moving with her family to Mars. In her life, in her eyes, living inside a dome isn't much better than in than a prison cell. Still, when Zahara commits a crime that has her running scared, Jill might be exactly where she's headed. Instead, Zahara is recruited into the honors, an elite team of humans selected by Leviathan, a race of sentinel alien ships to explore the outer reaches of the universe as their passengers. Sahara sees the chance to flee Earth's danger, but when she meets Z Zidam, the the alien ship she's assigned to, along with fellow honor Beatrice, Zahara starts to feel at home for the first time, along with de a devotion she never experienced before, yet nothing not her Honors training or her street smarts could have prepared her for the dark, ominous truth that lurks behind the alluring glitter of starlight. Uh, Honor Among Thieves is the first book in the daring new series by the best-selling authors. It sounds pretty good. That, hurt, that actually hurt my mouth because I got I get it pulled over here. So sounds pretty good. I got that. And then I only picked up two books this month, which is pretty, really pretty crazy, but... I picked up Truly Devious by Maureen Johnson. I was reading this for the 24 hour book uh, readathon, but I didn't really get too much into it. I think I only got to page 38. I did like what I read. Um, this is about a girl. She goes into a boarding school. Her name is Stevie Bell, and she is there for forensics. And there was a murder that took place, um, and there she tries to solve this cold case that's happening. And, um, she they could not solve the solve the case like back in i forget when the thing was like back in the 
when was it? The 19s, I think, or 18s, let me see. Hold on, guys. The 1936 is when the murder happened. Um, and the cops couldn't solve it, so she thinks she can solve it. And again, like the beginning of the book is pretty cool. Like the riddle that happens, it says, which is really kind of made me want to read the book. That's the riddle. It says, look, look, a riddle, time for fun. Should we use a rope or a gun? Knives are sharp and gleam are so pretty. Poison slow, which is a pity. Fire is festive, drowning slow. Hangings, hangings, a rope way to go, a broken head, a nasty fall, a car colliding with a wall. Bombs make a very jolly noise, such ways to punish naughty boys. What shall we use? We can't decide, just like you cannot run or hide. Ha ha ha. Truly devious. So, so that made me really intrigued to read this. I just put this down to read Harry Potter, but really good. So that's that book. And then the other book I picked up, which is Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. I bought this used, so it's kind of like a little banged up copy. Not that great. But at least, at least the spine's okay, I, I guess. Um, I, this is the fourth book in the series. I'm reading the third book, which is Prisoner of Azkaban, my favorite one. I just got into this, these books. I read the first one a long time ago, back in the day. Um, now rereading the series again. Well, finishing the series, because again, I only read the first one. Uh, I finished, I read in January, The Goblet of uh, the Sorcerer's Stone. Uh, February, I read The um, Chamber of Secrets. And then in March, which is now, I'm probably going to be finishing The Prisoner of Azkaban. So then in April, I will hopefully finish this behemoth, Goblet of Fire. And then along with that, I picked up the box set of eight films um I've been trying to do like the films and movies the films and movies so I mean the films the books so I've been reading like the book and then reading the, then watching the movie that's what I've been doing so so far I've only watched two movies because <laughs> I should have already finished The Prisoner of Azkaban because again that's my favorite book because I love my man Sirius Black uh but I've been kind of not really reading as much because my hubby uh, bought me a PS4, so I've been playing a lot of it. Uh, and the only physical game that I have right now is Destiny. I have a PS4, so I've been playing lots of Destiny. I love it. Um, I am getting more physical games. I'm definitely going to be getting uh, Sims 4 when that comes out. Oh, we're going to get it Friday because I love Sims. That's like my favorite game when I was a kid. Um, so I'm getting more games. I have other games on, like, the actual system. Like, I have Skyrim and Shadow of Mordor and Life is Strange and Nathan Drake. Because, again, I love Nathan Drake. Um, and we're getting the Uncharted 4. We have the whole Uncharted collection, but we're getting Uncharted 4 on Friday. Um, I have PlayStation Now, so I have all the old games. So I've been playing, like, Lego Harry Potter 1 through 4. Uh, right now I'm on Lego The Prisoner of... Azkaban on Lego Harry Potter, uh, Dead Rising. I actually play with my friend from Canada, so shout out to Will. Hi, Hi Will. I um I play Dead Rising 2 with him um, on that, and I just have been loving... I, I, I forgot how much I loved gaming. Like, that's why my, my YouTube channel for a long time was GamerDoll21, because I loved gaming so much, and I just forgot how much I loved it. Um... And so I'm back doing that. So I'm gaming and uh, gaming and reading at the same time, which is kind of trying to, to, to juggle it all together. <laughs> and then being sick and then my tooth, then being sick, it's like, oh, but feeling a little bit better. I'm hoping it was just a 24 hour bug and not the flu because we're supposed to be getting the flu again, I guess. It's the second strain of it or something. So I hope not, but we'll see. But yeah, my tooth is healing finally. It'll be a week tomorrow a uh, week two days from now that I had the surgery so hopefully it's feeling better it's getting better honestly but yeah so I'll start to guys if you have any questions comments leave them down below any video requests leave them down below I know I have a video request to do what's in my what's on my phone I'll be doing that probably the next video um but yeah I'll talk to you guys later all right oh and if you guys um want my PSN uh name on ps4 just let me know and i'll comment it down below so we can 
Get me out of the mechanical. All right, bye guys.